Hi, I'm Nenny. Thank you for joining me. Today I would like to give you a short demonstration on how to use the new foil transfer sheets and tacky when dry gel medium from TCW The Crafters Workshop. If you are a Ninny's VIP member uh, who also gets the subscription box, uh, then you probably have just received your subscription box for August and it would have included the crimson red foil transfer sheets as well as the champagne gold and a two ounce jar of the tacky when dry medium. This stacked pumpkins stencil, a slimline stencil from TCW was also included in the subscription box for this month. Uh, as well as another stencil and some napkins and a bunch of other fun stuff. But uh, we're going to use this stencil in the demonstration today. So I'm just working in my small uh, Cans and Mixed Media journal today. Um, I, at first I want to paint these uh, pumpkins, or sorry, stencil the pumpkins on with some orange paint. Uh, any acrylic orange paint will do. You see, I, I was going to start with a makeup sponge, but I actually much prefer stencil brushes. I find, for me, they work the best. I don't get any bleed. Uh, makeup sponges, yeah, are really great as well, uh, but I find I don't tend to get enough paint off of them the first time, and then I get a lot of bleeding. I don't have to worry about that with a stencil brush, and for me, it, it gives a lot more impactful, brighter color uh, the first try. I don't have to keep going over and over again. So this is the Stamperia size uh, 06 stencil brush, I believe, and I really love it. And you'll see once I peel this stencil back uh, how crisp and clean it actually is. Uh, and uh, I'm just putting the paint onto my gel plate. I like to do that because then later I just roll it out and make a gel print and I feel like I haven't wasted any paint at all. Uh, you know, I don't have to clean anything up afterwards off of the gel plate. And there you can see, nice uh, crisp, clean image from the stencil brush. Now we have some orange stacked pumpkins. I'm not a patient person, so I'm going to use a heat tool or an embossing gun to quickly dry my paint so that I can move on to the next step. It doesn't take very long to dry the acrylic paint. There's not a whole lot of it. Um, So now what I want to do is I, I want to add some nice uh, gold accents to these pumpkins. So I'm placing the stencil back over top, lining it up with the original picture. And I'm going to take a palette knife, uh, oh, which was also included in the uh, subscription box. Everybody got a plastic palette knife. But first I'm going to tape the stencil down with some painter's tape just because I don't want it to move. I want to really make sure that uh, I'm working on in the same area where I've already painted the pumpkins because now I'm going to put the tacky when dry medium uh, you could do this without painting the pumpkins first and just cover the whole stencil with the tacky when dry and make some really cool shiny shimmery pumpkins but I wanted to add some accents as if like uh, you know there's a, sh a shiny bit to the edge of the pumpkins maybe the sun's shining on them uh, I used gold for this but uh, now that we have all of the uh, foils in. I actually think I would have used the copper because it is kind of orange um, more so than the gold but as you'll see I mean this looks fantastic too. So I'm just using my palette knife to spread uh, a little bit of the tacky when dry medium uh, over parts of the pumpkin. I put a lot on the pumpkin in the middle and then you'll see I put uh, some on all of the pumpkins just along the edge and this is my first time using foils for anything, so I really wasn't sure what to expect. Uh, but uh, I was really happy with the results in the end. I thought it was really cool. So I'm probably being way too careful here. Um, I'm sure it's not that fussy. So I've sped this part up just a little bit. We're almost done uh, spreading it over the parts of the stencil that I want. Now I'm going to peel back the painter's tape. And as you see, it, does, it really doesn't look like much right now. Uh, that's when it's still wet and now we're dry. You can use the heat tool to dry it um, if you're like me and impatient. So now uh, what you're seeing here, there's I, I didn't really show it, I guess. There's a silver backing 
to the foils and you actually want to put that part down you might think it's the other way around but it's not you put the silver down and then you just use your finger or whatever and uh, just kind of rub over it you don't have to rub really hard just rub gently and uh, if you've missed any parts of the tacky when dry um, of course it's still gonna be sticky and you can just lay the uh, foil back over it again and push down again uh, see like I'm doing there I missed a spot there there you go and there you have it I'll show you a close-up of that there isn't that beautiful I just uh, I'm overwhelmed that something that's so simple to use could have such a amazing effect when it's finished and I mean you can imagine all the possibilities of it here is uh, another one I was playing with here I just put the tacky when dry through the jungle vibes stencil which also was included in uh, August subscription box and I used the red and gold foil for this one isn't that that's super cool so iridescent if you're interested in becoming a Ninny's VIP member, I will leave a link in the description box below on how you can do that. Uh, we have two different memberships. The first one is the Ninny's VIP membership, which is $19 Canadian a month or about, I think that's about $14 US a month. And it includes free shipping on all orders over $59.99 Canadian rather than uh, $129.99 Canadian for uh, non-members. Uh, it includes double rewards points, so on all your purchases, your birthday, your uh, when you refer a friend, you'll get double the points, and those do add up really quickly. Uh, you'll get a free digital printable every month, and you also get 5% off all Ninny's brand products, so Ninny's rice papers, Ninny's tear-resistant tissues, uh, and any other new products that we introduce in the future. The other membership level is the Ninny's VIP Membership Plus subscription box. So you get all the same benefits uh, from the VIP membership, plus you also get your subscription box delivered free every month. Uh, that membership level is $69 Canadian. Uh, I'm not quite sure what that is in US. It's about 45 maybe. Uh, it does say on the website an approximate amount. Um, so yeah, you still get your free shipping on orders over $59, you get your double rewards points, your digital printable, 5% off all Ninny's products, and then you also get that subscription box in the mail every month. Uh, last month, or this month, I guess August, the value of uh, the items in the subscription box was about $100 retail. Uh, and don't forget you're getting the free shipping as well, so there's at least you know $110 Canadian value. So you can see for your $69 a month, you're getting a really great value, plus you're still getting all those other uh, benefits from the VIP membership. If you are not interested in the subscription box at this time, uh, we have decided that we are going to carry all of the TCW foils and the Tacky When Dry Gel Medium uh, at ninniesnapkins.com so those are available now for purchase I will leave the links to those in the description box below as well uh, we have all the colors I think there are six colors uh, six six or eight I'm not sure and I'm sure they'll be coming out with more in the future uh, because they're really really cool so thank you for joining me today if you enjoyed my demonstration video I would really appreciate it if you could hit the like button uh, it would also be really great if you could leave a comment below and uh, subscribe to the channel for more videos in the future.